Hello there everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video I'm going to show you a cosy morning routine on a busy school morning where I'm on my own with my two boys, my partner is working away, so it's just me with the kids getting them ready before school. So it is about 6 30 6 45 a.m and cooper is awake i've heard him on the monitor so i'm just prepping myself waking myself up and i'm gonna go and get him he's always so happy in the morning he is such a little ray of sunshine and it immediately wakes me up first things first his highness always wants his milk so I'm going to get him a bottle, fill it up with milk and heat it up in the microwave. It's just before 7am now and my eldest has woken up and come downstairs and we always have a nice big cuddle when he wakes up. Sometimes he has a cup of milk as well in the morning, sometimes he doesn't. But they're just going to chill on the sofa together watching some telly. So while the boys are occupied there, I'm going to set up downstairs ready for the morning. I'm going to turn on the lights and I'm going to get some toys out for Cooper so that when he finishes his milk he can get down and start playing. I am going to light a candle because it is super cosy this morning. It's still dark outside. I actually love mornings like this and if I light a candle it puts me in a very cosy autumnal mood. I've also got my pumpkin mug so I'm going all out on the autumn theme this morning. I'm going to make myself a caramel latte to enjoy and to start my day. I always make sure to sit down and drink my coffee. I don't have a coffee unless I know I'm going to sit down on the sofa and drink it in peace. I don't like to run around doing things while drinking coffee, so I make sure to sit with the kids for five minutes and have my coffee before I get going. But <laughs> it is time to get going. So the first thing I'm going to do is make the boys lunch. They are both having a pat lunch today, so I need to make two lunch boxes. I'm going to make them each a cheese sandwich, and I'm just going to make it a little bit more fun and cut it into some fun shapes so the kids can enjoy that. I've got a whole set of cutters <laughs> in my drawer today. I've picked a star shape for Leo and then little mini star sandwiches for Cooper as well. All of the cutters and actually the lunch boxes as well are all in my Amazon store which is linked down in the description box below if you want to take a look and get anything for yourself. I'm also going to pop some fruit in the boys lunch boxes, strawberries for Cooper and mango for Leo and these cute little fruit forks so that they can pick at the fruit without getting their fingers all sticky. I'm going to put an orange in Cooper's lunch box as well. And Leo has requested hummus today, so I'm just going to pop a little bit of hummus in here. I will also pop another silicon cup on the top there so that the hummus doesn't go all sloshing around everywhere. And I'm going to cut up some carrots and cucumbers for him to dip, give them some crisps, and of course a little bit of pudding as well for afterwards. Now that that's done, I can make the boys breakfast. It's probably about 7.30 by this point. I'm gonna make them a super easy breakfast this morning. They're gonna have a chocolate brioche each, which I've just cut up into little pieces, and I'm gonna give them some watermelon to go with it as well. My eldest also has a multivitamin, and he has a fruit smoothie, but my youngest won't drink smoothies. He only drinks water, even though I do offer him a smoothie in the morning, he never wants it. So I'm just going to give him water to go with his breakfast as well. While the boys are busy eating their breakfast, I'm just going to pop upstairs quickly. I'm going to open up all of the blinds and curtains and wake up the upstairs of the house. Uh, 
I'm just gonna super quick get myself dressed. I make absolutely zero effort on the school run. I shove on some leggings and a <laughs> big baggy jumper and I throw my hair up. I never wear makeup or anything, so it literally takes me two minutes and I will grab the clothes that I need for the boys. Leo's uniforms are all laid out in his wardrobe so I can just quickly grab a set for today. And for Cooper, I'm gonna pick some clothes that I don't care about because he's going to nursery and he's gonna get filthy. Since going back to school a few weeks ago, I I've been getting the boys dressed downstairs rather than dragging them upstairs. I'm finding this a lot quicker and a lot more efficient if I just take the clothes downstairs to them. I also have my little get ready station in the downstairs toilet again so I don't have to be dragging everyone upstairs. It has all of their toothbrushes in there and it has all of the hair stuff that I need to get them looking smart. So we're all just going to brush our teeth together and I can do Leo's hair. <laughs> Cooper's moaning here because he wants his toothbrush so I'm just going to hand that to him and I'm going to sort Leo's hair out and it's just a super quick and easy way to get everyone ready. I've also changed up when I do reading with Leo. I've started reading with him in the mornings before school instead of in the evenings because I'm finding he's a lot more awake and is finding it a lot easier to focus first thing in the morning. So we just do that for five minutes. I'm going to pack all of their bags up with everything they need. And before you know it, at about 25 minutes past eight, it is time to put our shoes and our coats on and get out of the door. I'm going to put the boys in the car and then I need to come back because we have some homework that we need to take in for Leo today and when you see the size of it you'll understand why I had to come back and get it separately. Oh my gosh! But guys, thank you so much for watching my cozy morning routine. Don't forget to subscribe for three videos a week and I will see you in my next one.